Well, I suppose I'm deranged, but I guess I'll just have to call. Love you, is, darling. All right, second game of the Road to End War testing the list and uh, if you check the first game yeah that was awful Avatar as Warlord, two naked far seers on bikes uh, Dark Reapers with strength 8 missiles also speed and a trifle on the Exarch uh, basic extra Exarch nothing upgraded fast attack choice from the Dark Eldar because we are not using the FAQs, the fire that the green one is the fast attack. My allied forces, warriors, one blaster, dual venom, uh, dual cannon venom, every venom set that Lamian as a HQ, corpse thief claw with eager injectors, and three, uh, two sets of three bikes, no scatter lasers or anything, because I didn't have the points. That's 1847 points, and as I said, second test game uh, we're playing on the same game uh, sorry second game on the same table four plus cover on every ruin that is just an impossible building let's see and black templar power axe Poison flamer crusaders whirlwind Bikes, grab on the bikes, of course. Whirlwind, another one. Crusader, Melta, Power Sword, Crusader Squad, Squad, Power Sword, Plasma Gun, and another bike squad with Grab. Grab Turians, uh, uh, Dreadnought with double heavy flamers and honor guard with the captain and he would like to start but I stole the fucker yeah now it's a game uh, and we have uh, the maelstrom is where you pick three cards secure objective three domination And objective six, we have uh, that's a two, three, six, four, one, and the five in the middle. Now I'm contemplating, am I actually gonna get domination? If I sacrifice bikes, I might get. I got the domination. He's holding that one. Fix two points plus three. Almost one failed. Again, dangerous terrain. I made the save. Strength eight missiles killed that for Foyer's blood. They were not pinned and do not need to fire snapshots. Two of the Talos shot, but four four up saves made. Invisibility went off and shrouding went off on him you can do only two cards of maelstrom so i did domination and that objective and i have objective six in my hand templar turn one objective four we don't play kingslayer domination Oh she and objective six objective four six and domination that's the fast rhinot dual flamers didn't hurt the venom I made two saves one wound on the exarch and one died. Didn't have to jink. Bolters all tried to drill there. 
whirlwind skill 2 here, moral health just, roll the 10 because Parsi is on that unit. Honor guard got the relic. Pistol shot down the bikes, couldn't, couldn't make the saves, and shotguns shot down the other bike squad. He jinked, he had shrouded, graves were no go. He scored two kill points from the bikes, no points and tossed the domination obviously. In beginning of turn two, supremacy and objective number one and that's an upsec and I don't have upsec units. We are not gonna, we gotta, gotta destroy the dreadnought first. I have fire dragons there so that should happen. Supremacy. He is holding two and I'm holding for yeah. The babies did their thing. Relic is still there. Slay the warlord, two kill points. Extra two kill points for the third cherry. Which are from the formation itself. Basically I have one the third cherry already because I have four there and he can only achieve uh, Slay the Warlord and Line Breaker. Whiff Eddy Whiff Whiff. No hits. And then I shot uh, two strength, uh, strength eight shots there and one pen and one glance and he rolled four and a five. Got a kill point from the bikes. Did I mark that down? That was uh, from Psychic Shriek. Objective 4, which is there. And he has two times objective 4, so that's two points. And the uh, Dropper uh, doesn't come in. He's got twice objective four. Here, he assaulted. We all hit on agent one. He killed one and blew him up with melta bombs. Assured destruction. They came in, whiffed, lost one bike due to terrain, but he jinked the shots. They tried to shoot that farseer, didn't happen. That flat out of there, that there. Two points in the beginning of the third turn. It's Milestrom's is seven to two for the Deldar. Uh, five to two kill points also. And Relic is still rolling on the table. Two times objective six. Oh shit. And objective four. Ah oh, shit. Last of the reserves. We don't. Yeah, it comes in. After a last turn's 11 inch charge, I rolled three now. So no. They disposed of. One drop out and the bikes are gone. Couple of kill points and, and two times objective six. Objective one, he has it already. An ascendancy. Any three objectives. The centurions are here. Farsier gone from there, failed two, two pluses. They are gone because because centurions. He got two points for holding that, that, and that, and actually one under the drop pod on the left corner. And objective one.
I am contesting that one. Yeah, it was the fifth one. Yeah, that one, that one, and that one. That's the ascendancy. Sorry about that. In the beginning of the fourth, Maelstrom is 9 to 5, and kill points. I, I have 7, he has 5, and, and Relic is in the middle. The cards. No prisoners and few objectives. Another four inch charge failed again, but I got the relic. Stuck here in combat, which is great. Wift couldn't shoot those away. I needed those two objectives. I scored one objective by blowing up another drop. But they are on fire, dragons. Poison whittled down that unit. One point and one kill point. He has hold the line, secure objective 6 and secure objective 3. Thank god that's an upsec uh, venom on there. He's gonna take that one. They broke one wound on the Exarc and lost one. They came into the close combat with the warp spiders, but I hit and ran out of there because it's warp spiders. He finally did something kill the centurions so I got kill point also he had one milestone point from this round bottom of the fourth Eldar Deldar has 10 and he has six more milestone I'm in lead and kill points and I got relic there I still have objective five Objective 3. Objective 1. Which is there, yeah. The whirlwind is holding also the objective, so I actually... There's no point for me to eat the, that unit, because I've already got the tertiary at the moment. Loads of firepower, three venoms, and inside of that venom, I got that objective. Now, those dudes wrecked that rhino, and an avatar wrecked that uh, drop parts. Two card points, and three kill points. One snapshot killed one there. They are actually pretty good snapshotting. He, he has psychological warfare, that's the only unit that can break. Uh, because it's turn 5, all the Dark Eldar are fearless. Hold the line, objective 3, and uh, make me break. He got hold the line, ran those, and the whirlwind is there, and there's a rhino I couldn't kill yet. Kill point from here, killing the unit, killing one there, and one wound on the Exarch. The game goes on. I lead on kill points on Maelstrom, and I have the Relic and the Tertiary. Got that point behind enemy lines. Venom, warp spiders. They killed that rhino, and there's a venom. Made these guys run, but they didn't go off the board. These dudes and this that venom uh, were pretty shitty actually on shooting that the poison. Only killed like one or two. I got two points and one kill point from this turn. He has uh, objective 3 and objective 6. He has twice objective. Yeah. Thank god I wrecked the rhino. He would have got 2 points.
I got uh, 14 on Maelstrom, he has 7, I have kill points, I have the relic. So, well, much better going on, much better, better game this one. Yeah, uh, it's all about do I get the uh, start, do I get the start, because if uh, if the grab crew came in the first turn and uh, the dreadnought blocking the the corpse thief, then he would have had a chance and get the relic in in the early phases. So uh, there's no need actually, uh, no need to uh, count the exact uh, exact points because I took every single category in this game. Uh, turn in tournament we would calculate every point here. But uh, this was awesome. Yeah, Resident Prime signing out.